Hi guys, my name is Claire James Cole and welcome to the Black Widow Challenge in Sims 4. This is episode 4. I keep wanting to call this girl Isabel. It is not the teen one away, it is Imogen from the Black Widow. I will get to grips with it. But it'll take me a few parts probably to get to grips with it, but it's Imogen. Yeah, just done something really stupid. It was last night, last episode ended last night in the bar and so I kind of set off the episode to start, brought her home and everything and just been chatting, talking to you guys for about 10 minutes maybe um, and hadn't recorded, didn't hit record. What an idiot I am. What I have done is invited Don round. We're going to get married to, let me go and start, we're going to get married to Sergio today. And we wanted to invite Don round, like last night, like the night before the wedding, to kind of, because Don, I think, is going to be the next victim slash, oh my goodness, look at them. Wow. Victim slash kind of husband, whatever, has to be boyfriend. No, not yet. Let's just do some friendly things with him for now. Um, ask about day. Just friendly. Calm down on the flirtation. Um there's nothing that they want to do with each other other than like flirty things discuss interest it was just cause interest with him um yeah so we invited him around this morning well this morning yeah he wouldn't come last night because he was fast asleep um we've just been chatting to him and he's have i just said all this i feel like i have i don't know what i've said and when i've said it now because just with not hitting the record button right anyway yeah we're gonna get don maybe to be our next oh he's going now okay fine thanks bye <laughs> get Don to be our next husband. Seen as he's just gone, let's. He has been round since like seven o'clock this morning. To be fair, let's go ahead and plan our wedding. So plan a social event. I'm not sure. Sergio is in work at the moment. I'm not sure whether we will leave work to come to the wedding, or okay. will we have to wait till he's finished, yeah. or kind of what the deal is. No idea about that. So let's do a wedding. Thousand simoleons for a wedding. Bride and groom, yep, and then guests. Guests, I kind of don't want to invite the men. It's just going to be all women. <laughs> I don't want to invite the uh, the men that I'm thinking of maybe hooking up with later on because they might get jealous. So I'm going to try and like avoid. Definitely, Don. I don't want to come. That will do. Marcus, I uh, don't want Marcus at all so he can come yeah we'll do that so caterer i think we'll have oh clara or bob let's go clara mixologist she's new is she really brin Bri, how do you say that Bri briley brinley queen she's a new sim new to me anyway and musician we will hire Okie dokie, and let's find somewhere to go and have the wedding. We have got a wedding venue somewhere. We should have a wedding venue somewhere. No, why is it not here? Here we go, guys. So I have I figured out the problem. We are at this awesome, in fact, I've not really taken a look at it yet. It's the Wedding Garden um, Restaurant from, I think that's what it's called, off of the gallery. Oh, but hang on, have we not got a bar? Oh, I thought, I just figured that there would be everything we kind of needed here, but it looks like there isn't a bar. Who builds a wedding venue with no bar and no piano and... We've got a wedding arch, that's fine. And we've got somewhere where they can cook. Is that downstairs? There's a downstairs, hang on, maybe there's a bar downstairs. Oh no, toilets. Is this Imogen? Imogen, why are you downstairs in the cellar? Oh my goodness, right, we need, I don't know whether I can buy stuff to put in here though. Can I? I... Oh, it's only editable from the world map, okay. Ah, oh, right, let's go into the world map then. Ah, oh, you can't go into manage world or switch a household during an event. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be a failed wedding. We need a silver. Right, let's just see what we can do without a bar and stuff. This is a disaster. A disaster. We could thank a guest for coming. Where even... 
plate. Where is um? Oh, look, is that? Let's have a little look at Marcus over there. He looks swish. Look at him in that suit. He looks nice. And I think Candy. Oh, look, she looks nice as well. Is that Candy? Yes, it is. She looks nice as well. It's the hair. It's the hair. Okay, so what do we need to do? We need to have drinks, which we can't do. We need to have guests watch the ceremony and thank a guest for coming. So, I mean, I guess we should get married first. That's kind of... Or should we... Let's thank someone for coming. Generally, we wouldn't really have seen them beforehand, would we? Let's go and thank Mortimer. Thanks for coming. She's She best not like be trapped downstairs. I have no com... <gasps> what was that? Little sneaky little rendezvous in the toilets before the wedding. I like it. I like your style. <laughs> right, come out and thank somebody. Do you know what? I'm not going to thank Mortimer anymore because he's too far away. I'm going to thank Marcus. Thanks for coming, Marcus. Is she coming out? What is she doing? Where even is she? Where's she gone? Oh, she's gone out there. I should Ah. Uh. This wedding is just going to be a disaster. Like, kind of like the marriage, really, is going to be a disaster. <laughs> I like her dress, though. I like that she's wearing that red dress. That's really nice. Look how nice she looks. She could have done with, like, a nice little necklace or something. Maybe red lips. Oh, no, her makeup's not too bad. She looks pretty. I like it. Okay, flirt with each other. Well, let's go and do the ceremony. We've thanked someone for coming. Let's get married to Sergio. Here we go. Are we going now? Stop chatting to everybody else. Let's go and get married. And everyone. Oh, we're feeling tense. Or some. There's a tense conversation or something going on over there. Never mind. Is she going to make anything? You go best go and make us a cake, Mila. The last wedding I had, there was no cake. I had to make the cake. In fact, it was um, Isabel's, wasn't it? It was Isabel's wedding to Emiliano on 118. She had to make her own cake at a wedding. Are we going to get married? Get married to. Come on. Speed this up. Are they coming over to get married? The time will be run out by the time we've done this. Oh, eight hours left. There's a long time left. Hang on, stop. Is anyone going to come and watch us? Do we have to ask them or will they just come over, do you think? I think they will just come over. Let's watch this because, wow, I really like the um, like that wedding arch with her dress and everything. Looks like it was planned. This is so cute. Ah. Uh, I say it's cute, they're just gonna like, she's a horrible woman, but, <laughs> oh look everyone's come to watch, oh apparently we've had first slice, don't know when that happened, but okay, what a beautiful ceremony, Sergio's exchanging vows, wow look everyone's so happy, oh they've all come gathering round, let's hang on, let's see it from the other angle, through the arch, we can't really see it for the fountains. Oh! Yay! They're married! You can have your married sims move in together by using this split and merge button in the household management. Do you think we will get him, or we need to get him, to come and move in with us? Oh, here we go, look. So. We've got silver. We only need to get silver in terms of like the rules of this challenge. We have to get a silver on the wedding. And we have got silver. There's not much chance of us being able to get anything else particularly because we can't have drinks. And unless actually she... Does she need a side? I don't know whether she needs like a, another... Like a, a side unit thing there that she can cook on. I'm not sure. But um, we haven't got that if that's what we do need. I'm going to... Ah, oh, be enticing. I think what I might do then is wedding over. Short, quick wedding because we can't do anything else with it. Disaster. Fancy. If you build wedding venues, guys, and put them up on the gallery. I, I'm like, this is really cheeky of me to be saying this because I've never built anything. I'm an awful builder in this book. But if you do build stuff, Put a bar and put a piano in it, please. It just makes it really useful when you do, like, get download the um, download thing. Uh, right, I'm gonna go ahead and end 
There's five hours left. End early. Let's end and let's get just married. Congratulations on your new marriage. Would you like to move? Oh, there we go. So it just asks, would you like to move in together? Yes, we would. Is he going to bring any money? That's the thing. Was he, like, living with somebody else or... Oh. Ah, okay, so Sergio lives with... Ah, oh, he was one that I was potentially thinking about for... Um, for, uh, like, for next um, partner thing. So, technically, he, right, so he's not going to be... He's got 20,779. Is he going to bring any of that with him? How does it work? I don't think he does, does he? If he doesn't... Am I okay to cheat that 20,000 in, do you think? Because that was that's kind of the point. 20,779. Let's see. Or we could, like, split it, maybe. So, like, he leaves half the money, depending on, like, how many sims are in the household. So there's, like, two other sims. Then he gets a third of the money when he comes over. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. I think that might be the best idea. Like, you get a portion of it. Maybe, yeah, he didn't bring anything. Late for work. He's just got married, that's why. Never mind, right, let's go home. Everyone, everyone's like, okay, mass leaving of the wedding. <laughs> let's go. It's all done. Okay, back at home. Here they go. So now I'm controlling Sergio as well. Oh my goodness, she's starving. That's because there was no cake at the wedding. It was terrible. Let's... I want to woohoo with him. Hang on, let's click on the bed. And woohoo, should we have children? I feel like I don't really want her to have children because I feel like she's not that kind of a woman. She's like all about the money and you know, just is getting married to different men all the time and she doesn't want to be tied down with a child. Obviously that may make it harder for her to go out and meet new people. I have a feeling actually that Sergio hates children as one of his, where do I? Yeah, he's active, materialistic, hates children and business savvy. I need to write down that money, don't I? It was 20,000, 20, I think I'm going to cheat half of that in. If you guys think that's wrong, let me know in the comments, but I'm going to go ahead and do that now. There you go, guys. I have added in 10,000 simoleons. I think that's a fair way to do it, to be honest, but let me know what you think. I, yeah, I think that's fair. He was living with his mate. They had 20,000 household value or whatever it's called. He gets half of it when he leaves. I think that's perfectly fine. Right, I think what we need to do now is... Ooh, he's a silly little thing, isn't he? Well, go to work. Should we... Can he go to work? He, like, he's supposed to finish work in 10 minutes, so no, not really. Um, what we need to do now is have a dinner party to show that we are kind of the perfect wife. So he can... He's there. We invite all our friends around. In fact, we probably need to do up this house a little bit. I think I would probably do up the house a little bit in between episodes with the money that Sergio has brought in to the house. In fact, we definitely do because we haven't even got a dining room. Maybe if we're not we're not having kids, so maybe we can do, convert this back bedroom into a little dining room or like move this bedroom or you know, just have a little mess around with the house and create a dining room. This actually would be all right. We could put a door here from the kitchen into the dining room. And he's very into his exercise. He keeps dropping and uh, doing push-ups pull-ups I was gonna say they are not pull-ups they're push-ups um, so yeah so next episode we're gonna have the dinner party invite all our friends around show how we are the perfect wife and then we're gonna kill him <laughs> right there you guys thank you so much for watching this episode let me know what you think about Don as the next potential partner down below in the comments thanks for watching and I will see you guys soon for a new video bye